Laryngoscopy in adult. We displace tongue. What happens in pediatric do we displace or not? In adult laryngoscopy, the tongue is displaced laterally, usually to the left, by the laryngoscope blade to clear the line of sight to the larynx. In pediatric laryngoscopy, the tongue is also displaced, but with some technique differences due to anatomical variations. In neonates and infants, the mouth is often opened by placing a finger on top of the tongue, and the laryngoscope is inserted carefully, sometimes with less aggressive tongue displacement. Because the pediatric epiglottis is more floppy and the vollecula less pronounced, a straight blade is often used to directly lift the epiglottis rather than indirectly by placing the blade in the vollecula as in adults. This leads to a more gentle tongue displacement, but the tongue is still moved to improve visualization. Summary Adult Tongue is displaced leftward with the laryngoscope blade. Pediatric Tongue is also displaced but often more gently. Mouth opening in neonates may involve finger placement on tongue. Straight blades lift the epiglottis directly. Tongue displacement still occurs to clear the view. Thus, in pediatric laryngoscopy, the tongue is displaced, but the technique is adapted to the anatomical differences, generally involving less sweeping and more direct lifting of epiglottis, especially in infants and neonates.